there, welcome to the Teeny Tinkers channel. I make ball jointed doll and craft related content. Today is an unboxing of a gift I've received from my friend Dean. Dean, also known as Plastic Collective over on Instagram. And I have uh, been sending each other little gifties for a little while now. Um, originally, uh, Dean had sent me some fan mail way back when and I was blown away and I had to send them something in return and so on and so forth. So. This year, um, Dean approached me and asked if I would like to do a craft exchange independent of the Christmas craft exchange. I said, yeah, sure. We had to kind of pull it a little longer than the Christmas craft exchange because I was in the middle of moving and all that stuff. But um, I have received my package today and it's here and it's wrapped in LOL paper. How cute is that? Yeah, this is just an unboxing of a gift package um, of dolly goodness, and I'm just really excited to get into this because Dean sends the coolest stuff. All right, we have opened that package to reveal another package. I can hear something moving around inside, and I'm very excited to get into this. So we have a box of yellow goodness. I love yellow. I love a lot of colors, but yellow is one of my favorites for sure. Um, so let's see, we have, oh, it's tissue paper and then all the gifts are wrapped in LOL surprise paper. Looks like there's a card to Rosie from Dean. And then there's this cute washi tape on the back. Super cute, attention to detail. Um, oh my gosh, how cool. I think this is supposed to be a drawing of Soleil, um, but like chibi. Oh, 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 my goodness, we're spoiling things. Oh, I'm not gonna look, I'm not gonna look. Something fell out, but we're not gonna look at it. So this, first of all, amazing um, hand-drawn, what is that drawn in? It looks like a bit of a mixed media. There's some paint, maybe some gel pen, I'm not sure. But that's incredible. I've never framed a card, but today might be the day. This is such a cool drawing. Uh, and I'm pretty, I'm pretty sure that's meant to be Soleil. And, like amazing so the card says first of all it's adorable um happy holidays rosie thank you so much for doing this exchange with me i know you're busy between all your projects family moving on top of regular life stuff it means a lot that you took the time to do that it's been awesome following your life and dollies the last couple years i'm wishing you the best hope you like everything xoxo dean p.s the extra chain links are to expand the chain or if one breaks okay it looks like there's some replacement parts but just like, that's gorgeous. Um, I'm in love. And what fell out were some stickers. Oh my God, these are my dolls. Oh my God, more stickers of my dolls. Oh my God. This one, I'm not sure if it's one of my dolls. This might just be one of Dean's, but this is Luna, 100%. With the glasses and the hat. And oh my God, this is Luna. And I have a whole bunch of them. And that makes me so obscenely happy. Are you gonna tell me these aren't the cutest stickers you've ever seen in your life? Um, I'm gonna have to put one of these on my iPad case 100%. We we'll have to put another one on my notebook um, and everywhere else in my life. Dean had made me a couple stickers before. Of It was back when I was mostly collecting and not making dolls so much. And um, I had them on my laptop until they eventually wore off. Um, but like, Love, 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 love. Okay, let's get into the boxes. We have one little box, two little boxes, and three little boxes. I'm gonna start with the smallest because that's what I always do. So again, in this really cute LOL paper, some ASMR. Okay, I love the little bows too, they're so cute. All right, so in package number one we have, Dean makes the cutest jewelry. Um, I have so much jewelry from him and um, they're all my favorite. These are next level. Okay, so I'm seeing in, the, in this cute little Barbie case, but I'm seeing some that match pieces I've already got. And I love that because I love to layer bracelets like that. I'll put a better um, video in showing everything too, but some super cute rainbow bead stuff. And then there's like a more delicate pastel rainbow bead. Uh, but then there's this kind of stuff. And first of all, 
This is a Hamtaro necklace. That's inc that's incredible. Um, I loved Hamtaro as a kid. Uh, it was one of my favorite favorite TV shows: Sailor Moon, Hamtaro, um, Pokemon, Card Capture Sakura. But yeah, um, this is freaking cute. Uh, there's also uh, this choker with a little star. It's like a neon orange with a teeny tiny little star. That's precious. And then there's, oh, this is cool. So it goes like this and it's just like very kid core. Some of the outfits I'm planning for like Clover and Poppy are very kid core. And these, this, the Hamtaro are gonna be amazing. Um, there's also these two that are these bigger. It reminds me when I was, I was a scene kid. Um, I was, I've emo forever uh, seen as a partition of that, but um, I was a scene kid and I always wore these necklaces with these big beads, um, very childlike. I, I did got like all my accessories at Claire's um, and Claire's isn't what it is now or wasn't what it is now. It was very Hello Kitty child jewelry um, when I shopped there. Um, now it's like, little teenager stuff. I don't know what's going on, but, um, and then again, perfect for the kid core look is this little teddy bear pendant. It's so precious. Um, I am in love with all of these pieces and <laughs> I cannot wait to, especially like this Hamtaro one is sending me. It is so good. 20 of it. Oh, and here's the extra links. Dean was talking about. I might also use them as like a little bit of a chain on a pair of pants. I think that that would be adorable, but uh, super duper cute. Heck, I might even I might even put these on a pair of pants, not as a necklace. I might put them like where you loop them on the sides of jeans. I think that would be phenomenal. Okay, I'm gonna open this one next. I'm hearing some. I'm hoping I'm not gonna break anything, but I can hear something sliding around. This is so cute. So it's a mystery box. I love like blind boxes. I love art toys, like Pop Mart and stuff. Um, this kind of stuff always makes me super duper happy. And it's like these like little cats. They're all the donut cat. There's a donut cat on the side. Um, that might be donut cat, unicorn cat. Actually, there's like all of them. I like all of them. Um, so let's, let's just go ahead and open this up. So it's got a little card. Is this gonna spoiler it for me? Oh no, it's like a collector's guide. And then on this side, and then I got, I see an orange one. I think I got Burger Cat or Taco. Taco Cat, I got Taco Cat. I'm so excited. Tacos are like short of Korean food, but tacos are my favorite and burritos and all Mexican food. Um, are my favorite. Um, oh my God, the guacamole on his head. That is so precious. And he's got this like little, oh my God, he's so cute. I love him. He's gonna go up on my shelf with my pop marts and stuff. Thank you. Last one. Got some packaging, keep the packaging together so I don't make my office a ridiculously big mess. So this one's, it's, it wanted me to open it first, but I persisted and I resisted. And now I get to open the last one, the biggest one last, sorry. And it is one of these, oh my God, that's so cute. I've never seen this one before. The Real Littles backpacks. These are so cute and they have like little tiny things in them. So we're gonna open it up. I can almost guarantee everything in this will go to Clover and Poppy in their bedroom. Um, Oh, you can see right there, Poppy and Clover on the bunk beds um, in the kid room. They have a Squishmallow collection started too. But um, also, quick aside, um, I used to collect the blind boxes. They were called Micro Mallows. They were like two inch or 2.5 inch Squishmallows. And they don't, I can't find them anymore. Um, I can only find Squishville, which is okay, but they have like weird little outfits and I'm not into that. Um, so if anybody, and if anybody in particular has a Wendy Micro Mallow that uh, they will sell me for a reasonable price, please let me know because I love Wendy and she's my favorite. Anyways, anyways, 
Um, so it's this little backpack. And they do have little straps. So they are like wearable. It's so soft. Like that's Clover's. I think she might have a real Littles backpack or just a different backpack, but Poppy didn't have one. So this might be Poppy's backpack. And again, the, the kid core theme, like they're not dressed like it now. I'm in the process of making the clothes I want them to have um, and before I start styling them, but like it's gonna be adorable. Okay, so the first thing in here is a pencil case with a little uh, bear and a rainbow on it. And that actually opens, you can actually, I think a lot of times there's like pencils and stuff you can put in the case. Uh, we have a tiny ruler. It's super cute. And then we have, oh, we have some stickers, little itty bitty stickers. I'll probably put those like, where would kids put stickers? Everywhere, everywhere. Um, and then there's oh, this notebook. It's like holographic. It's so cute. Oh my gosh. And I can write Clover's name on the front. It's so shiny. Um, or Poppy, I'm sorry, I always default to Clover because she was here first. Tiny pencil. Super cute. For the scale, this is like one of those jumbo pencils. You know when you were a kid and there was always like those, maybe, maybe, when I was a kid there was like pencils that were like this big around and they were like this long and it was like a joke thing and there was also erasers for big mistakes. Um, and kids in my class would rub them on each other and call each other mistakes, uh, <laughs> which is both hilarious and traumatizing. But um, that's what that's reminding me of. And then we have an eraser with pizza on it. That's adorable. And then we have some more stickers and a carabiner. This is like, I don't know if it's, is that what you call these carabiners? Um, I think that would be a cool accessory. I want to put that on someone's pants too and just like hang keys and stuff from it. But um, like, that's really cool. I, I freaking love that. Um, and then the backpack itself is again, adorable. But yeah, um, pretty much everything I think fits inside here, except for like the notebook and all that. But um, yeah, so much cute things. I'm so, so pleased with everything. I especially love the handmade jewelry and the stickers and the freaking card, like the card and like, say so I want to put it in a frame, but also it like loses its texture. But anyways, I am extremely, extremely pleased with everything. Thank you so much, Dean. Uh, this kind of stuff makes me so happy. I love doing these like little gift exchanges and craft exchanges, um, especially with friends. And uh, when, cause when you do it with friends, you kind of know, like you know each other a little bit and you try and send stuff the other one would like. And Dean has knocked it out of the park once again. Um, if you haven't checked out Dean's Instagram, it's Plastic Collective. He makes, I believe, stickers and other stuff. So definitely, and jewelry, check him out. Fantastic work. Um, if you're already subscribed, thanks so much for subscribing. If you're new here, I hope you like the content and consider subscribing. As always, I hope you have a fantastic day. Bye.